up your head, beat up your body Get on the bus, it's time to party It's Gregory, it is a Friday night Gregory Take your socks off and take your pants on Get in the car and drive Hello everybody, welcome to Friday Night Greg, Friday Night Energy on a Wednesday morning. Right now, I gotta be honest, it's a takeover. Welcome to the beach takeover. It's not Friday Night Greg, it's a night with night cream. Kingston, Jamaica. Joining me is Mr. Beats, the doctor of sounds. Oh, AKA uh, Christopher Cream. Dan Harumi, what's up Danny? Hey. Great. Uh, <laughs> second in command, we have a guest. Woo! You know him from Here's the Scenario podcast and from eating, always finishing the food on its plate. That was really mean for no reason. <laughs> Just <laughs> waste food. <laughs> thanks, for, thanks for having me. <laughs> now, I'll take that as a compliment because uh, I really do like food. Finishing my plate. Yes, you do. It's really fun to talk into singing. Yeah. That's like what lounge singing is about. Really? Yeah, you know, you go like, uh, hey, what's up, lady? How you doing? You look great. And I love this man. This man is gonna attack you. Scoobity bop the ow. Scoobity bop the ow. The ow be Watch uh, out. This man. This man. Giancarlo. Giancarlo Esposito. Esposito. He's awesome, dude. He is great. He could do anything. Yeah. He's going to be. Is it confirmed? No, it's still rumored that he's going to be Professor X. In whatever X Men thing that they're making, I think it should just be Patrick Stewart until the day he dies. Till they gotta grab those bones, yeah, out of the dirt, throw them on a, throw them on a plate. I love Logan so when, up. when he's just carrying Patrick Stewart around, he's oh, just like a rag best. doll, and just yeah. throw. Him. I'm Patrick Stewart, and this is what I've got to say. Patrick Stewart is all. Was born in May, and I like to play Xavier, where I sit in a chair and I'm play with her. And her is her head, her is her mind, her is the phoenixes of any kind. It's me, Patrick Stewart. Sure, Patrick Stewart. He's a knight, but you can kill him with a sword. He's the weakest knight. Have they knighted anybody recently? Are there any new knights? Max! You're Can gonna you want. Check it? Has there been a new knight? Can you check it? Pull it up, pull it up. So, what do you guys think about him? He's a good Professor X, right? I think he could be good in whatever he does. Right. See, they got to get a, like a Latino Magneto wow. now, though, too. Because it's got to match. Saying. Yeah. They yeah. wanted to get like Denzel or something to play Magneto, but to me, Magneto's got to be Jewish. Because the whole thing is he was in World War. I get it. The Holocaust happened way too long ago now. Yeah. But you got to figure it out. <laughs> hey. Alternate universe. Yeah. Smoke weed every day. Smoke weed every day. Every day. I think I would like to see uh, Denzel in the MCU in some way. Maybe he could play. Who would he play? Who could he play? Who could he play? <laughs> Who would be good for Denzel? Who would be just respectable for Denzel? Who could he play? Uh, he could play my Uncle. He could play Uncle Ben. I'm so That's sick. That's a minor of part, though. What? That is a minor part. And I'm sick of seeing Uncle Ben. I want him to go away forever. Oh. That's, but Smoke that's... weed every day. <laughs> <laughs> that's not even was... a reggae song. <laughs> <laughs> I was talking about the Uncle Ben origin story where he's a uh, cartel. He's taken down the cartel <laughs> in Mexico in 1935. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He actually learned the phrase with uh, great power comes great responsibility while spending time in prison. With mucho power. Yeah, with mucho power comes. 
Mass responsibility. <laughs> I found the most recent knighting. Who is Where's your bell? Kind of a soccer <laughs> okay, player. Your bell. Little Nas X. Little Nas X. <laughs> it was Little Nas X. Little Nas X. It was, Little Nas X. It was uh, Lewis yeah. Hamilton, the uh, Formula F1. One driver. What? I don't really give a fuck. It's because of the Netflix show. Wow. Everybody watched that Netflix show. Now they're just handing out knights. That's crazy. I like that little flute. It should be people who are heroes. I might be a hero. You might be. A hero to you is a hero to me. But then why would Patrick Stewart or Elton John be knighted? They're not heroes. Yeah, I don't think they should be knighted. It should only be heroes. It should only be heroes. You wanna be a knight? Here's five things you gotta do. Hit me. Hit me. You gotta see the old lady from a train. If a train's coming at her, if it's coming at her brain, oh, you gotta jump on the tracks, throw her up, then push the car. Oh, that's number one. That's one. Love being a knight. <laughs> Take your turn. <laughs> I'm into it. What's rule Get number two? Rape. Okay. How do you find one that's on you? But you gotta stop a rape. That's what you gotta do. That sounds a little not right. No. <laughs> 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 Sorry. <laughs> You have to find someone in a rape fantasy with their boyfriend or husband and but, stop that. But that's consent. Not according to that sound. Uh, I got a suggestion. Uh, knock door to door. Be like, many rapes going on in here. Trying to stop a rape. Doesn't want to be a knight. Th and then three, what do you think? Gotta be cool. You gotta be cool. You gotta to hang be out, a knight. Tell me about you it. You gotta be go. cool to be a knight. You gotta talk cool, look cool, speak cool, be cool. Everything about you's gotta be freaking cool, man. If you're a knight, I want my knight to be cool. I don't want some nerd who's gonna ruin it. <laughs> I don't want some nerd. Oh, also, if I'm not laughing, it's because I'm doing a count in my head to see what the next <laughs> is. I'm laughing internally. Don't take it personally. Because I see I, you looking at me like, I'm, I'm literally counting me like five. I did say four, that thinking three, I was going to get like two, a laugh from one, you and it got nothing. And cool. So sorry. Yeah. Yeah. So great. here are the rules of a night, yo. One, you got to stop crime. Stop crime. On a train. On a train. Number two, stop rape. Stop door to door, stop raping. Number three, number three, number three. You gotta be cool. You gotta be cool. You gotta be cool to be a knight. Uh, it ain't right if you're a nerd. No nerds allowed in this castle. <laughs> oh, leather, denim, cool ass shoes, blacked out shades. You're a knight now. <laughs> you know what I'm saying. <laughs> Backwards hat. Talk to a girl at the mall. Get her in your car. Now you're having a date. Because you're fucking cool. But what if that date goes bad and you start to rape? Then who's going to stop the knight from raping? A knight? A future knight? <laughs> that brings me to room <laughs> number four. I didn't know there's more rooms to this. Room, room. Not that many rules. Number four is each, five. Rule, each rule is just a lot. It's yeah. Five. Yeah. <laughs> rule number four. You know how it is. What's that? You gotta travel through time. Well, that. And check on nights. Oh, oh yeah. So you gotta rape a night or a night throwing people off a train. Whoa, that's not cool. Nope. 
number four keeps you in check. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Looper. You a time traveling Looper, son of a bitch. You're a medi m medieval Looper. You're a medieval bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Why, but you. <laughs> Imagine you would be in a night, you're just doing your night shit, right? Yeah. Having a great time, having a blast. Uh -huh. Then all of a sudden, rule number four guy shows up and goes, I'm rule number four. And he goes, I got to take you out because you're not cool. And you're like, what? I thought I was cool. I'm a knight for being cool. And you're telling me I'm not cool? That like hurt your feelings, you know? That yeah. would hurt your feelings. But what if that knight kills the looper knight? Yeah. Well, I gotta say something. They win because you know what that is? Do you know what that is? Do you know what that is? No. Maybe. <laughs> That's cool. Yeah, yeah. Now I think I'm getting it. Now I think I'm getting so it. So won. And now he's cool. You gotta be cool. That's rule number three. You gotta be cool. You see how this all works? I love this. Saying enough, you get the song. <laughs> <laughs> is that all five or was that four? We got one more. Oh, okay. Yeah. There's five rules. five rules. Number five is There's five rules of being a knight. How I there is five rules. Of being a number five, Harumi. It's on you. You gotta be good to your family, man. Wow, oh, that's a good rule. That's a very good your rule. mother, your father, cousins, brothers, mother, sisters. father, cousins, sisters. You gotta be cool to your family. That's rule number five, and it's all right because if you're the type of guy that'll save someone from a train and stop a rape, then you're pretty cool. Then you're probably really cool to your family. Then you're probably really cool to your family. Now's the time that you gotta time travel. You got to time travel. You got to time travel. Greg is. Damn. Uh, this is like a Drake beat. Me. Jesus couldn't skateboard. When we do the re. Uh, In your bed. Chris couldn't skateboard. You thought it was good. You just hung out by the half pipes and never did tricks. Oh, Jesus used to skateboard. He wasn't that good. Just hit on girls. Let me for the flaters. Jesus used to skateboard. Wasn't that good. Jesus oh. used to skateboard. He wasn't that good. Oh. Jesus used to I always hated skaters like that. Yeah. Always judging people. Did you board? Yeah. Did you blade? I I, I skateboarded. Hell yeah. What was your max tricks? Tell me about your tricks. I landed a very old kickflip once. Got to do it twice. That's brother, as far as <laughs> is that really the rule? You gotta the do rule. it twice. I think I've done it more than once. I think I did it more than once. I know that I just I just said I did it more than once, but I I. I remember being able being to land modest. it a couple times. You remember the proverbial once. Yeah. Which is two. Yeah, once one as day. In, yeah. One, <laughs> as, yeah. Once upon a time. A hundred percent. Once upon a time. Skateboard. It wasn't that good. Uh, used to hang out with weirdos. What are you getting from your bag? Jesus uh, used to skateboard and he wasn't that good. Yeah. And that's your fourth step to becoming a knight. <laughs> Smoke weed every we day. We already did five, but we could do six. All right. But I, I said, well, no, it's being cool. That's part of, yes, that's part of voice. Right? Yeah, that's that's rule number cool. three. That's a big one. 
You gotta be cool if you wanna be a knight. If you wanna be a knight, you gotta be cool. Oh, we did that song already. <laughs> this is just a nice. We can go back sweat. if you want. Huh? No, <laughs> I don't wanna go back. I don't wanna go back. Only forward. Wish I had an edible on me. Was my weed? Do you believe in Jesus? No, 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 no. I don't. Jesus Christ. Why not? Cause. Well, I guess I don't have a reason. Not a real clear reason. Cause I don't have a reason. Jesus is real. Do you ever believe? What? I just believed. Cause now he's my reason. He's behind me, isn't he? The father. The s- <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're hilarious. Wait a minute. He's if behind I'm me, over he? here <laughs> and you're over there. Man, next time I do my uh, my real, my atheist shit on stage, middle go. of the bit, I'm gonna go. He's behind me, isn't he? <laughs> he's, he's all Only around one me. One set of footsteps here. <laughs> Jesus, you scary boy. You wasn't that good. Hung out by the half pipes, just judging that wood. Jesus, you. St- okay. Here we go. Damn, we gotta figure out a smoother uh, song change. Oh, you gotta figure out a smoother song change. That's what I'm saying. I agree. <laughs> that throws you in the middle of a hook. All right. Brendan. Yeah. How's this girl going? How's can I say everything's that? good? Yeah, she's a comic. I know. I just make sure. How's Feeny doing? Just Feeny. She's very good. Yeah, we're we're actually uh, we just decided today that we might move in together. What? Wow. September first. It's a huge step. Nice. But we've been dating for a year. I'll tell you this. In New York, that's not really a big step. <laughs> yeah, you can move out pretty quickly. Everything gets easier pretty quick. <laughs> oh, yeah. I've been looking at places <laughs> with her and noticing the price and going, man, I wish I knew that this was an option. Yeah. <laughs> the places are so big. The places are so nice. Yeah. And I don't have roommates if I live with my girl. I hate to do it, but man, wife really would have rhymed there. Yeah. <laughs> Me. <laughs> Subconsciously, you wanted it, but yeah. I didn't even <laughs> notice that shit. Yeah. Damn. I hate to do this, man, but wife would have rhymed perfect. <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. Yeah, because now you share one bedroom. Also, That's all right. Share the grocery. Love it. Love it. Sharing the cable. Sharing the cable. Sharing the Wi-Fi. Sharing your heart. That's the most... The hardest part. (laughs) (laughs) When the goo goes into your heart. Yeah. And she's got a cat. Ooh. And I love this cat. It's a cutie. You allergic? No, I'm not. What's the cat's name? Ogre. 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 Yeah, from. Ah! Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, what? Um, it's from the Dark Crystal. She named her cat after the Dark. You ever watch that on I Netflix? Fuck me. Let me tell you this: the original Dark Crystal I loved. The new Dark Crystal. Here we go. Was so fucking good. But uh, every episode was like a billion dollars. Yeah. It was so bad. It's so long too. You didn't like it? No, I haven't finished it yet. We're we're watching it, but very slowly. Wait, wait. It's so wait, long. Uh, every episode. Her cat. After someone from the Dark Crystal but didn't finish the show yet. No, she finished it. She's showing it to me, oh, and nice. I'm uh, I'm trying to watch it. So we call the little kitty Augie, and the, and she sits around. She does not like to be held, and that's fine with me. Augie the cat. Augie the cat. Augie right. the cat. How old's the cat? Two, I think. It's a, she. She's a rescue. 
Oh, you're gonna spend a long time with this cat. Moving in with a girl is great. Tell oh. me why. I agree, but tell me why. Because I, I was looking at, you know, I'm, you never really feel ready. Right. And I was looking at her today and I was like, I think I'm ready to move in with this girl. Right. Well, you're not ready because you've never done it. I have. I lived with a woman for five years, and oh, I, I wasn't ready. I met with her. Oh yeah. I met with her. Like, yeah, yeah. So, oh, it's gonna, it's gonna be a change. It's gonna be a big change. Right. But the best thing about, because I'm married, you know, that married style life. Yeah. The best is like, just like fifty percent of things in your life you can kind of like they kind of handle. Yeah. You know, like, and you handle shit for them. Uh, no, I really mean like, I'm <laughs> more men- mental. Stuff, but laundry, sure. Cleaning, you should do the laundry. Yeah, you do cleaning, something. cleaning everything cleaning. up. You know, yeah, yeah. <laughs> cooking. Yeah. yeah. All you got to do is bring home the bread. Yeah. Oh, which I don't. <laughs> Let me ask you this. Yeah. Uh, is the career thing gonna be tough? Let me finish. Cause you're both comedians. It's gonna be tough. Like if she gets something, gonna be jealous. But if you get something, are you gonna be jealous? I don't think so, and I hope that that doesn't happen. I'll tell you what, I've got plenty of stuff. And she's kind of, you know, there were some times that she was like, Oh man, I'm jealous. But... Her first reaction is always like, oh my God, that's so great for you. I love you so much. And uh, I'm just so, like, I, I don't care. I hope she gets shit. I want us to be a money-making power, power couple. Power couple. Yeah, that would be Voss, fucking awesome. Bonnie wow. McFarlane. Yeah. yeah. I want to be for the sure. Bonnie McFarlane to her rich boss. <laughs> <laughs> Michelle Those are Barack. the same thing. <laughs> Michelle Barack. Obama. Obama. Yeah, I mean, I used to live with Anthony. Yeah. And guys then, are a power couple. Power. Yeah, a lot, power of, a lot of money coming into that apartment. Power top. Power all the time. Oh. With a big bed. It's 69. Oh. Evenly distributed love. Oh. Okay, so. Yeah. Uh, with Anthony, he would get stuff and he would feel bad telling me because he'd be like, like I, he'd be like, oh, you know, I didn't want you to get jealous. And then I, I went, hey man, if I did, that's my fault. That's not on you. Yeah. And so then once you kind of like really free yourself from that, totally you choose to not. It's such a choice. Yeah. I don't realize you can choose. You can go have these feelings. I'm gonna put them on a boat. I'm gonna ship them out. We get into that in the Patreon episode. Yeah. If that's a call forward. Oh. Uh, yeah, yeah. So that's great, man. Yeah, I uh, I totally agree. I mean, all that all that shit is really uh, it's like all mental. Yeah. You know, like I don't want her to fail. I want her to be getting shit and yeah. do stuff. Like. Good sign. Yeah. Good sign she just got passed in New York. That was a big. That's that's awesome for everybody. New York Comedy Club. We're doing a show there, right? New York Comedy Club. Oh, yeah, we're doing uh, something. New York Comedy Club. We're doing a show. Night Crane. Night Crane. At some point. Also, you'd be great on the live show. I would love to do the live show. Um, I could totally get lost in this shit. Host of this shit. Most of this shit. The live show's great. With a bit. It's real fun. It's it's way more intense. But I like this because the studio stuff is real, like... Yeah. No pressure to get a laugh. Honestly, I feel like there's some of the the lights gotta go down. Oh. I wish Max. you can turn off this light. There's no dimming, so it's either gonna be this or really dark. Right. Yeah, I think for the well, cameras, this is probably. We'll better. keep this yeah. fun, yeah. <laughs> In the future, though. I'm just saying. <laughs> Dan and Max are what I like to call a party, 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 party. <laughs> Sometimes you need it. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Keep me. No, no, it's all right. <laughs> <laughs> it's all, you think it's hard to not interrupt people on a normal podcast? Yeah. Try when you have to take a giant pause for a breakdown. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When you're like. Dead silence. <laughs> yeah. Party. Party, party.
Yeah, it's like when you're singing something, and you're like, well, I know I gotta take a, a, I have to take a rest here to like, for that beat. Yeah. And then someone comes in with, oh, I wanna sing now. <laughs> oh, I want it. I want to sing now. I'm gonna what? interrupt you. So I do this. I put my hands up. I think you guys were reading it pretty well. Okay. I'll put my hands up like, I'm like, like if I go like. Put your hands down and then uh, how many it. how much calcium is from a milk cow milked cow in the sky how much calcium would you get or does it taste like regular milk when you get it from the sky or is there a little is there a different <laughs> taste <laughs> Yeah, if you're out, so no. Dude, there is, there is really, it's, it's unbombable this because you can just start, you can get into something, then you can just go, and if if someone else is doing some, you can add to them, right? Like, you know, yeah. I want, I want to put you on spot. Do something. No, I'll, 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 I'll do yeah. Something and I'll, add. Uh, I'll, I'll talk about the winged cow. Winged cow, if you put a wing on a cow. It can fly, and whoever had the milk that comes from a winged cow, I bet you haven't, I bet you haven't, I bet you haven't never had a winged cow milk or some steaks from the sky, if the milk is from the cow, you're gonna want to cook with the milk. You're gonna wanna drink that milk, baby, yeah. I could do this till the day I die. I don't want to attend to my responsibilities cause I like singing in this room with you guys here right now. I like singing about the flying thing with wings on a cow. I like singing and I can do this with an auto tune. Don't you dare turn off that auto tune or I will leave you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pegasus, they got shit on me. Cause I'm a weak cow. Yeah. Yeah, right? This feels so good. It's fun. It's like, it's like, uh, meditative. I hope, I hope right now some kid, some 16 year old college kid, is listening to this. Mom walks in the room and goes, What the fuck are you listening to? I was hoping I'd walk in on you jerking off. (laughs) I would have preferred it. (laughs) (laughs) It's a window. How long we in, Max? 28 minutes. Stand up and dance. (laughs) So we are. We're coming along to the middle of the pod, and that's a nice place to be. Middle of the road. Halfway home. Yeah. Halfway from the diner. Uh, you having a good time, Harumi? Having a good time. Yeah, this is nice. Too. This feels yeah. good. This is so much better than the Patreon's gonna be. Oh, we yeah. should talk about that a little bit real quick. <laughs> yeah. We already recorded a Patreon, and everyone should listen to it because <laughs> it's a fucking mess. If you want to understand what goes into this. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. My Canon, it's it, original podcast is supposed to be Brendan Sagalo and my Canon and Night Cream. Uh, but man, we had some major audio issues. I don't know. I don't know. I thought it was a good episode, but the energy the was there. The, the energy was there for sure. But the comparison, this is way better. I mean, I could, I'll listen to a whole album of this. Oh, we <laughs> Even though we moved on, uh, but I think it's a wild, old school throwback. The Red Dude Cast, where it is chaos and great. Yeah. I think this might be the regular episode. <laughs> oh yeah. Don't right. don't you guys. Speaking of rad yep. dude cast, don't you guys have like a, an episode that you buried in the ground or something? Yep. <laughs> Am I allowed to talk about that? Yeah, there's an episode. 
There is an episode that I left buried in the ground. That there, if you listen to the Rad Dude cast, there's hints, <laughs> and the hints will lead you to coordinates. But you'd have to really be pay, like writing notes on it's the like GPS coordinates. Yeah. yeah. Wow. Like and if Anthony's like, I love being 32. <laughs> yeah. And 32 North. I buried the episode <laughs> in a. Yeah, I put it. It's on a CD, and it's buried somewhere. I'm not telling you where. Uh, wow. Wing cow. Wing cow. Wing um, cow. But Yo, the, the thing is, I don't even know if someone dug it up already. Someone probably already found it. But I don't know. Wing I'm not cow, back. perfect. Laughing all the way to the bank. Yeah, yeah. I'm laughing all the way to the bank. The blood the bank. bank. <laughs> I'm laughing all the way to the blood bank. Don't know why I'm laughing. I hate giving blood. Ugh. Makes me pass out. Not good. And it makes me shout. At least that's what the doctor said when I fell to the ground and I woke back up. They said you were just shouting real bad. Sorry that we took the blood from out of your head. Bag would work there. But it made sense. <laughs> Stop <What>? doing that. <laughs> Greg's got a sound right as mine. It's just always running for. Him. <laughs> also, I never <laughs> rhyme myself. <laughs> <laughs> you want to know my kid's Halloween costume? What? A wing My cow? son's name is Calvin. We're gonna dress him like a cow, and he's gonna be Calvin. <laughs> cow. I thought you were gonna say that you were gonna dress up as Calvin and Hobbs. Wing cow. <laughs> when it gets in your head, there's nothing it's hard you can to do get out of it but a bullet. Wing cow, <laughs> it's a cow with wings. I wonder how much they get calls at the suicide hotline. Yeah. Like, I got this shit sent. <laughs> it's either this or singing. I don't know. I can't tell I what's like, worse. This is like the other, this is like a separate beat than Wing Cow was or whatever, <laughs> uh, which I like because now it feels like uh, this is like Wing Cow Part 2. Like, right. This is like R. Kelly's. Still yeah. in there, yeah. Trapped in the closet. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Or Confessions Part 2. Is tool in the shed. That the word. I don't remember the words. <laughs> it's hard to remember the words when you're not it's singing. A wrong <laughs> <You're> wrong <laughs> <turn. laughs> well, I'm not the sharpest tool in the shed. I gotta say this. There's not a lot of sharp tools in the shed. Well, there's a hatchet. Right. Screw, guess, screwdriver, maybe? Screwdrivers could be pretty sharp. I guess, but I feel like primarily the tools aren't sharp. No, they're usually like used to beat I guess. or unscrew, turn. The hammer's not the sharpest tool in the shed, but probably one of the most used. Maybe Somebody. he's maybe he's saying sharp is like, as in like the works way? the best. You know, maybe it's kind of a metaphor in another way. It's hard to have a conversation yeah, with Yeah, it really is. It's hard to even, because I'm trying to remember the rest of that song. Ain't the sharpest tool in the shed. Max. What's up, Max? I just took the headphones off to see what it would sound like without hearing the music, just your conversation, <laughs> no. and yeah. it's pretty wild. <laughs> I would imagine. Yeah, it makes uh, very little sense, but it's you pretty do cool. A, that's what your Patreon should be. It should be a released <laughs> recording of you doing it, yeah, without any music behind it. Where we're like singing and we think we're so good <laughs> But actually it sounds so freaking bad, man No, yeah, but it sounds Somebody <laughs> Yeah right, Ooh. Feel it Oh. Smell yeah. it Let's Breathe this one in Breathe it in a second Man, I love a girl with a big butt I love some girls with some big tits ah. But I also like a girl who 
Let, 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 listen. I like a girl who will listen to my problems. Want a girl who will listen all day long. Because sometimes it's not girl talk, it's girl listen. But she's also got to have a big butt. And some big old titties. I'm mad at my mom. <laughs> what? I'm mad at my mom. Father Ren. These are my problems. Oh, it's just name of the problems. The oh. girls gotta listen to. These are my problems, girl. Got no money. And I eat like shit. Yeah, yeah. Uh, huh. Eh. And every day I go through the Burger King, King drive through what on my feet. Well, I get a Bacon King meal with some fries, some large Coke, and it really does a number on my fucking stomach. And I have diarrhea. I get diarrhea from it every day. Burger King on his feet. Burger King on his feet. I got it's Burger King, King on my feet. Burger King on his feet. Now, let me tell you something. I've been there. Yeah. You know, I like to date a girl. What I like in a lady is a few things. Very simple. I like a thin little waist with some big ass titties <laughs> and some nice eyebrows. Nice eyebrows. Ooh. I like a girl with an underbite, like a fish. Uh, long ass legs, small ass hips. Yeah. But uh, what I need the most, aside from her body, I need a girl. Who will listen to yeah, me yeah, complain? Yeah. Oh, that's insane. Uh, I like to complain. Oh, that's insane. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Last but short my check. <laughs> no <Nine> bathroom. Spots. <laughs> <laughs> no bathroom on the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> my mom is dying of a cough. My brother didn't return my call. That's so sad. Big ass titties, little ass waist. But big ears. But some big, big ass, ass ears. ears. <laughs> <laughs> little titties, little ass waist. waist. But big ears. Big, big ass, ass ears. ears. <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> Big ass ears, big and ass ears, and a heart. <laughs> it really takes it out of you to do this. Oh, you get yeah. you get very like, you know, it's like uh, a lot of energy but, goes into this. So that's the thing. That's when you start cooking. Yeah. The real is you've got to get the first hour out of the way. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, the yeah. I'll tell you. Uh, the first hour is all self conscious, and then yep. you're just pulling. And then you're just getting it <laughs> out, it's dude. Like I love it. Schwarzenegger used to do a hundred reps. And that's when it would start. Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Burnout time. When the brain is gone. I got three spots after this. <laughs> I have a spot after Breaking this, too. on my feet. Yeah. Yeah. My shoes. Well, they are cars. Burger King on my feet. My shoes. They are cars. <laughs> Big ass titties. Oh damn. Uh, really uh, How are we on time, Maximilian? We're almost at 40 minutes. Oh, time's just going by. I real quick, I gotta did a little bit of housekeeping done here. That's hey, man. Right. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
five dollars every tear. That's how we roll it. All that money goes into my kid's mouth. And I don't mean like I'm buying food for them. I mean, cash money. I cash the checks and I shove that dirty money in his mouth. That's how I keep my kid from getting sick. Yeah. Because yeah. it builds, it builds <laughs> All immunity. All the cocaine. Yeah, immunity. Mix it up. Brendan Sagalo and Mike Cannon from Here's a Scenario. It was a blast. It was a wild boy thing. It was a blast. Yeah, yeah. And we may have said some things that shouldn't go out <laughs> to the real world. Specifically to one building in one room and one person. <laughs> Don't do it again. I'm just <laughs> Patreon. Double Patreon. And I don't have enough time. <laughs> Everything is now Patreon. Party! <laughs> don't stop the party! Party on! So go over to the Greg Stone Zone, patreon.com slash the Greg Stone Zone, and sign up $5 a month. Am I worth a cup of coffee to you? Coffee's actually more expensive. <laughs> Inflation. So ask yourself. Yes. Yeah, the only prices that didn't go up were my coffee Patreon. Coffee is six. Yeah, that's funny. You know? Coffee is only six dollars. Five thirty-four. A Starbucks coffee is five thirty-four. Sign up. Sign up your mom. Take her money. Then party you. Oh. Back to you, Brennan. Pod's not over yet. Oh, sorry. I oh, thought no, we no. were. Are you doing it's plugs? Really or we... Yeah, oh, I thought we, we were doing plugs. plugs. I thought we had more time. I know. I was just trying to. I like to do the. I like to do it in the middle so they can't, you know. Sign oh, out. Oh, okay. Should I plug mine? My, my plug, 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 three, two. Brandon <laughs> Sagalow.com for dates. One more time. Brandon Sagalow.com for my dates. <laughs> I'm going to be in Toronto in August. I'm gonna be in Texas in September. I'm gonna be in Chicago October. And you can check out my Twitch stream, twitch.tv slash sex to riches. I'm cream on these bitches, yeah. And that's it. And that's it. Also, you could follow me on Instagram, follow me on Twitter, and follow me on TikTok, and follow me on the land. Yeah, that's pretty my good. That's pretty good. Harumi, man, where do they want to? Uh, follow out? me on uh, Instagram, Dan Harumi. I just put out an album on Spotify, some music. Nice. I got a bunch of new music coming out. I got a bunch of stuff. Follow me on Spotify, Dan Harumi. I'm the wearing the Mets hat. Wait a minute. Are you no. No, this is like Dan Harumi solo stuff is now uh, available. Oh, yeah? To stream. What's that like? I didn't know you were doing that. Yeah, yeah. Uh -oh. I got a bunch of new stuff about to come out. I got oh, some like uh, orchestral Night music. Dreams separating. Are you singing? I'm going to do some singing. I got some rap stuff. Nice. I'm doing like uh, ensemble, like string, string orchestra stuff. It's going to be sick. What's happening here? 
No, I got, I got. like making music. I got things going in, in the works, man. Is that why we are using all the same old beats? What do you mean? This guy. <laughs> <laughs> we'll talk about this later. Singing this guy is so funny. <laughs> this guy thinks he's getting something over on you. This guy. I... What do you say? I think he's trying to cut me out. Ruby's trying to cut me out. Yeah, I got, I got plate spinning. Cream. It's oh, also uh, cream. night cream. We're doing stuff. We oh, got, yeah. we got a show Village Underground August first. Yeah. Yep. Doing Cypher Sounds show. New yep. York Comedy Club. Show. Greg just got us on yep. the New York Comedy Festival. Nice. Which, how often do they do that? I feel like it's always the New York Comedy Festival. Yeah. It is a year year round festival. Yeah. We already we did the last yeah. one. <laughs> also, I, guys, check out my Spotify, Greg Stone. I'm also putting out some music on my own. <gasps> Greg's yeah. fine. Uh, you know what is it good. called? Greg uh, doesn't know his password. It's called. Uh, it's called. Uh, Greg Stone and the Money Makers. Uh, it's called Electric Joe and the Fuse. <laughs> my name is Electric Joe, and we get electric. Electric Joe, Electric Joe. Oh, I feel like the band's breaking up. No, the band's not breaking up. It's getting bigger. Cause we're getting hot. We've had some party. Oh, all right. Oh, you ever uh, hear this beat before? Let me hear. In a world. Have I heard this? I don't think I know this. In a world know. where mimes are. Robots. In a world. <laughs> In a world. Where you got minds, evil robots. They aren't talking, but they're killing. That's what they do. They put me in a box. They put me in a real box. But it was invisible still. Couldn't figure it out. They're actually pretty cool if they were an evil. Oh, no. How'd you get out? How'd you get out of the box? I just kind of stood up. What? It turns out the box doesn't wasn't real. It didn't exist. It wasn't real. They were just putting me in a box. That's how they do it. And I fell it fell for it because I'm stupid. I'm a big old stupid dummy. Evil mimes, robot mimes. I just thought of something. Hit me. Ah, uh, I didn't see the movie, so maybe this is what it's about. Oh, in a quiet place. Oh, you couldn't talk. No. So the mimes could take over and live totally cool, right? Maybe they'd put one of those monsters in a box. Yeah. I didn't see it neither. What are you gonna do? Remember Bird Box? Remember that movie? Sidra Bullock. Oh, I don't like women. Oh. Craig. Podcast over. Oh. Thanks for having me. Thank you for coming. I was just kidding. Oh, <laughs> I thought that was perfect. <laughs> Does everyone end it? I don't um, like women. I do gotta. I gotta. We gotta uh, go. Yeah, we gotta go. I gotta, gotta, gotta go, go in like ten minutes. Yeah. We all gotta go. We all gotta go. We, all gotta, we gotta go, go to the bathroom. Someone's Thank everyone for listening. Check out Max Marcus at Max Marcus Comedy on all platforms. Follow me on Instagram if you don't. I'm uh, trying to get to 10k. I'm almost there. We're cooking at 8k. Mm. So uh, follow me on Instagram, Greg. Let's uh, go. Also follow Night Cream 2000 for uh, Night Cream clips. And man, I'm telling you, this Night Cream shit is getting talked about. It is getting, people are getting pretty excited about it. So, uh, you know, f- get on board now. Get in the basement. Sam Morell brought us up on his podcast. Nice. Sam Morell loved Night Cream, which was crazy. I awesome. Think. Yeah, so that's cool. And also, uh, Night Cream we rules. Of, we got some good times coming future wise. Uh, come to a live show. There's nothing like it. All right, we'll see you all soon. Anything else? Smoke weed every day. Good night. Big up your head. Big up your body. Get on the bus. It's time to party. It's Gregory. It is a Saturday night, Gregory. Take your socks off and take your pants off.